I think the danger of AI is much greater than the, the, the danger of nuclear warheads, by a lot. Mark my words, AI is far more dangerous than nukes. I try to convince people to slow down, slow down AI, to regulate AI. This was futile. I tried for years. The biggest issue I see with so-called AI experts is that they, they think they know more than they do. Um, and they think they're smarter than they actually are. By 2030, AI is far more dangerous than the nuclear bombs. These alarming words were uttered by none other than visionary entrepreneur Elon Musk at the 2023 AI Safety Summit. The man behind Tesla and SpaceX, known for his futuristic visions, wasn't optimistic about our AI-driven future. Instead, he was sounding a dire alarm. But Musk isn't alone in his grave concerns. In a shocking move that sent ripples through the tech world, Jeffrey Hinton, dubbed the godfather of AI, recently resigned from his position at Google. His reason? To warn us about the very technology he helped create. Let me show you. So you left your job with Google in part because you say you want to focus solely on your concerns about AI. You've spoken out saying that AI could manipulate or possibly figure out a way to kill humans. How, how could it kill humans? Well, eventually, if it gets to be much smarter than us, it'll be very good at manipulation because it will have learned that from us. And there are very few examples of a more intelligent thing being controlled by a less intelligent thing. And it knows how to program, so it'll figure out ways of getting around um, restrictions we put on it. It'll figure out ways of manipulating people to do what it wants. Hey there, tech enthusiast. Welcome to another eye-opening video by Simply Learn. Today, we are talking about an important question that's on everyone's mind. Is AI dangerous? Now, you might be thinking, dangerous? But AI helps me pick my best Netflix show. And you're right, AI does that. But it's also doing so much more, at a pace that's left even its creators stunned. Imagine a technology so powerful, it could be more devastating than nuclear weapons. A digital brain that could solve our greatest challenges or become our greatest threat. This isn't a science fiction, folks. This is the reality we are hurtling towards the breakneck speed. Now, you might be wondering, what exactly is AI that has these brilliant minds so worried? Picture this. You know how our brains work, right? We take in information, process it, and then make decisions or solve problems. Well, AI is like giving the ability to computers. It's as if you're teaching machines to think like us, but with a supercharged twist. These high-tech computers can crunch through mountains of data in seconds, spotting patterns and coming up with solutions way faster than we could ever. Let's take ChatGPT4 for example. This AI, which powers many chatbots you might have played with, performed better than 90% of human test takers on the uniform bar exam. That's right, it could outlawyer most lawyers. GPT-4 has shown remarkable improvement in dozens of standardized tests. Many measuring reasoning skills, we are talking about machines that can think, not just process data. This rapid improvement is exactly what got experts worried. The big concern is that we are racing towards what's called Artificial General Intelligence, AGI. This is the point where AI can improve itself without human intervention. Imagine an AI that can learn and evolve as quickly as AlphaZero learned chess, beating the best players in the world after just 9 hours of self-play. Now imagine that kind of learning applied to, well, everything. Now, some of you might be thinking, super smart AI could solve all our problems. And you're not wrong to be excited about the potential. AI is already doing amazing in the healthcare, helping doctors diagnose diseases more accurately. It's changing entertainment with those thinking of accurate Netflix recommendations. It's even in our cars, helping us to navigate traffic and in some cases even drive the car itself. So, let's discuss whether AI is dangerous, four risks associated with AI. But before that, let's hear to what Elon Musk said on this. 
government oversight uh, because it affects the, it, it's a danger to the public. And so when you, when you have things that are a danger to the public, uh, you know, like let's say, um, so food, food and drugs, that's why we have the Food and Drug Administration right. and the uh, Federal Aviation Administration, uh, the FCC. Uh, we, have, we have these agencies to oversee things that uh, affect the public, where there, there could be public harm. Um, and you don't want companies cutting corners uh, on safety um, and then having people suffer as a result. So uh, that, that's why I've actually for a long time been a strong advocate of uh, AI uh, regulation. Um, so that I think regulation is, uh, f you know, I, I, it's, it's not fun to be regulated. It's, it's so, sort of uh, somewhat of a, it's somewhat arduous to be, to be, to be, to be regulated. Now let's dive into the risky businesses of AI. And trust me, we are not talking about a little game of chance here. We are looking at some serious potential pitfalls that have even the smartest folks in the tech deeply concerned. First up, we have the security. We often worry about hackers accessing our Facebook accounts, but imagine the potential consequences if they could infiltrate a super intelligent AI system. Next, let's discuss about governance. We are already facing challenges in figuring out how to control AI. Now picture the complexity of establishing rules for an entity far more intelligent than us. Then there's the issue of transparency. Just as we sometimes struggle to understand why our phones behave strangely, comprehending the workings of a super intelligent AI which is far more daunting. This is known as the black box problem. Inputs and outputs are visible, but the internal processes remain opaque. Akin to understanding the thoughts of being that processes information exponentially faster than we do. Finally, we have the bias. AI learns from data, but if the data is biased, then the AI can adopt these prejudices. We have already witnessed AI systems reflecting human biases, which is concerning. Imagine a super intelligent AI making critical decision based on flawed biased reasoning. It would be akin to giving a biased judgment, extraordinary powers and allowing them to impact the world on a massive scale. Then we have the control problem. It is what experts call the control or the alignment problem. Once AI becomes super intelligent, we may not be able to control it all. It could manipulate humans, act in both virtual and physical world and potentially cause harm on an unprecedented scale. Think about this way. Why would we expect to be able to control something that's vastly more intelligent than us? It's like an ant trying to control a human. Any defenses or protections we try to build into these AI systems could potentially be undone in seconds by a super intelligent AI. Now, I know what you're thinking. Can't we just unplug if it goes wrong? Well, a super intelligent AI would likely anticipate this and take steps to prevent it. It's like trying to outsmart someone who's a million times smarter than you. Let's hear from this video. More than 1,300 tech industry leaders, researchers, and others are now asking for a pause in the development of artificial intelligence to consider the risks. Twitter and Tesla CEO Elon Musk and Apple co-founder Steve Wozniak are among those who signed a letter calling for a six-month break in the race to develop more powerful AI. Musk and others say advanced AI, which allows computers to perform tasks that normally require human intelligence, could pose, quote, profound risk to society and humanity. So what are we doing about this? Well, nearly 28,000 people, including tech bigwigs like Steve Wozniak and Elon Musk, have signed an open letter calling for a six-month pause on advanced AI development. But not everyone agrees on the best path forward. Some argue that these AI models aren't conscious so they are less likely to break free from their programming. However, as many experts point out, consciousness isn't necessary for something to be dangerous. A nuclear bomb isn't required, but it can still cause massive harm. In the same way, an AI doesn't need to be conscious to potentially pose a threat if it's not properly controlled. So where does this leave us? Well, it's clear that AI development is moving at a breakneck speed and the potential risks are serious. But it's not all doom and gloom. 
Many companies and researchers are working hard to address these issues and make AI safer and more trustworthy. They are setting up ethical guidelines for AI development and use. It's like creating a rule book for how to play nice with our new AI friends. They are also appointing AI oversight teams, making sure that the AI behaves and doesn't color outside the lines. Companies are also getting smarter about who they work with. They are carefully vetting AI vendors to make sure they are not just labeling AI on the sub-bar tech. And they are staying on the top of the regulations too, because let's face it, the law is still trying to catch up with all this new technology. But here's the thing. We need more people working on these issues. As we navigate this brave new world of AI, we need people who understand both its potential and the pitfalls. Craving a career upgrade? Subscribe, like, and comment below. Dive into the link in the description to fast track your ambitions. Whether you're making a switch or aiming higher, Simply Learn has your back. So, if you want to enhance your career in AI, here's some quick info for you. Check out Simply Learn's postgraduate program in AI and machine learning with Purdue University and IBM. This program is perfect for aspiring AI enthusiasts and professionals looking to switch careers, gain expertise in generative AI, prompt engineering, chat GPT, explainable AI, machine learning algorithms, and many more. A year of experience is preferred. Hurry and enroll now. Find the course link in the description box and in the pinned comments. Remember, this isn't just a debate for tech experts. The development of AI will affect all of us and so we must engage in this conversation. And if you found this video helpful, do not forget to like and subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell. Thank you. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.